It was in Gombe some 40 years ago that Jane Goodall witnessed something that no one had ever seen before. Something that changed the way the world viewed not only chimps, but humans as well. I was walking through the vegetation one day and it had been raining and the first six months money I had, which was all I had, was running out and I knew if I didn't see something exciting before that money ran out, that would be the end. And then I saw this black shape hunched over a termite mound. I peered through my binoculars. I saw a hand reach out, pick a piece of grass, and clearly was using this as a tool, pulling it out from the termite, the, the burrows into the nest, and picking the termites off with his lips. And that was what was supposed to make us most unique at that time. Humans and only humans use and make tools. We were defined as man the tool maker. And so now we have to redefine man, redefine tool, or accept chimpanzees as human. Termite fishing is only one of nine chimp tool behaviors witnessed in Gombe. Resident videographer Bill Wallauer sees termite fishing on a regular basis. Basically, it's like this. Just grab a tool or twig like this, strip all the leaves off. So they'll make a fishing rod like this. They'll come up and they'll start digging around. They'll look for any kind of a hole to get into this mound and they'll start fishing with it. Chimps love them. Great food source, great protein source. Well, I know it's kind of a bit weird, but I do eat them occasionally and they're quite good. It tastes a little bit like cashews. 